The newest Washington National, Ryan Rayburn. Um, we talked to you the other day when you got brought up, mm -hmm. but uh, you've gotten a few days now with, with this club. What are kind of the, the emotions that you feel after grinding it out in the minors for the first couple months and then you get the call up, not just to a big league club, but one that's in first place? Yeah, I definitely don't think I could have imagined coming to such a good club that this is, you know, they're all around pitching, hitting. I mean, it's, a, it's one of the better clubs I've been a part of my whole career. So, um, you know, it was, it was, quite honestly, it was just like my first time coming up, you know, going back to the minors, you know, just trying to prolong my career as long as I can, you know, um, just trying to give my body as, as much as I can play in this game and uh, until I can't. And, uh, you know, but it's a blessing, you know, the Lord's blessed me to be able to play this game and be able to come here and, uh, you know, try and help this team win as many ball games as, you know, hopefully I'm here for a while, but as long as I am, um, you know, I'll just try and do what I can do. Not to say that you didn't appreciate your big league time earlier on in your career, but mm -hmm. do you have a different type of appreciation for it now that you've you've been around so long? And as you said, you you are kind of get you know the experience mm -hmm. is is getting up there. No, I think you know because that's one thing I never did was take this game for granted. Because I mean, you see so many players come and go, and 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 for me to be able to keep playing this game as long as I've been, you know, uh, like I said, man, I've been blessed, and um, you know, I cherish every day I've been able to get you know step out on this field and compete with all these. You know, these good caliber players, you know, I mean, especially in this clubhouse, you know, you got these young guys coming up. I mean, they're they're very special. So to be able to still hang with these guys and uh, compete with them, I mean, it's it's been a blessing. So, uh, you know, but that's one thing I've never done. I've never taken this game for granted. 2015 was a great year for you. I think you only played in 80 something games, but your numbers were fantastic. Mm -hmm. What was going well that year? And. Do you try and pull up tape to to maybe find some things that were clicking for you in that 2015 campaign? I think we always do. I think we're always trying to find that same feel that we've had years we've had, you know, good success. I think the biggest thing, though, is being healthy. You know, a lot of my down years, you know, uh, you know, something's been hurt, you know what I mean? Just trying to play through it. And, and the talent that's up here, it's hard to it's hard to compete and be successful, uh, successful. I mean, because... I mean, you see the players out there in this room, and you got them all through baseball. I mean, it's hard to it's hard to compete out there when you're not close to 100%. So, you know, that was probably the biggest issues. But, uh, you know, like I said, it's just just playing this game, giving everything I got. Some years it falls for you, some years it don't. You know, um, but it's always fun to be out there and compete. Well, we're excited to have you here, Ryan. We look forward to seeing more from you. Thanks Thank for the time. You. Thank you. I appreciate it, Bob. Johnny, send it back to you.